What's up, it's your boy 360 Jeezy, and I'm doing this review on the Wall Magic Clips. All right, and I'm gonna give y'all some 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 pros and cons. I'm gonna tell y'all a little bit about the clipper. Y'all make sure y'all stay tuned and watch this review. All right, this clipper right here is the truth. Stay tuned. All right, YouTube, I already opened this box up, but I'm gonna open it just real quick for you guys so you guys can see what's on the inside and what it comes with. It usually comes with the clipper inside. Of course, I used it. it comes with these two guards. It's actually a 316 and 116. Comes with the guard holder for the clips. Put it on here, save the teeth from getting damaged. And it also comes with a charger, so you can charge cordless wall clippers, so. All right, YouTube, I'm finna hook this clipper up to the charger right now. The light turns blue. When the light turns off, that means it's fully charged. You can use this clipper with the charger on it and cut all day if you want, uh, but once you disconnect it, it's running off of the battery that's inside. Yeah, once it goes out, it goes out, but you can always hook it up. It'll be at full power and you can cut like this with the charger attached to it. I wanna give y'all a little sound check real quick. Let's test how loud these are. Let's compare it to these wall balders. These are only wall clippers that I do own besides the cordless, but let's compare it to these. I'm gonna give you guys the pros and cons to this clipper, starting with the pros. First pro is that it's cordless. You don't need a cord hooked up to it and you're cutting and you're, you're trying to yank the cord because the cord is in the way. That's, that's one of the best things about this clipper is that it's cordless. Another pro is that it fits perfectly in your hand. It, it forces you to flick out because of the shape of this clipper. It's like the perfect blend, like you could get a perfect blend just by, by the shape of this clipper alone. So that's a, another good thing about this clipper that wall design, like it's, it's, it's perfect for your hands. Another good pro is that these blend really nice. When, when fading and doing a taper, it leaves a soft blend to it. It's not like a harsh blend, it's like a real smooth, transition so this is a good clipper for blending final final pro is a uh, final pro <laughs> final cut pro uh. <laughs> Final pro to this clipper is that you could kind of lightweight use Andy's guard on them you know it, it shifts it shifts a little bit it does shift a little bit but it forces you lightweight to you know how, if, if anybody is ever heavy handed and you know, you, you're you beating up a client, this will force you to go lighter and pay attention to how hard you are actually pressing on the head. Like you don't wanna beat your client up with these clippers. You wanna just gently pr press it on their head. That's how you get nice, even fades. You know what I mean? It's like this right here will force you to be more gentle with your blending. You know what I'm saying? Don't don't be beating your clients up over the head. Be more gentle, all right? So uh, it actually does shift, but it actually stays on there pretty good. It has two magnet. I use the ones with uh, two magnetic uh, magnets on the back and uh, it actually I mean for me I I, I I couldn't use a wall guard without them you know what I mean I couldn't I, I don't like using wall guards because wall steps it just isn't the same steps as Andy's uh, guard so that's that's the biggest pro that that I found for these clippers and now what we all been waiting on the cons all right the cons of these clippers is when you turn them on you can't necessarily hear the hair being cut. I don't know what it is, maybe it's just me. I mean, this is just me. Um, I can't really hear hair being cut with using these. Like, I, I, when I cut hair, I go by the sound of the hair and what I see, so if I'm trying to get that last line out, it's, you're gonna have to go on your own judgment because these are real quiet when they cut the hair. It's not like you can hear 
when you're cutting the hair, it's not like that. You, it's, it's, it's real quiet for some reason when it cuts hair. I mean, it could be a good thing or it could be a bad thing. For me, it's a bad thing because I actually want to hear what's being cut. Another con about this clipper is that it's, it, it, it could be a con, it could be a pro. I mean, it's all up to the barber. It's really light, like it feels cheap. Like it's so light, it's, it's so light it feels cheap. But for me it's kind of a good thing because you don't wanna be holding a heavy clipper all day while you cut hair and it's just weighing on your arm and your arm starts to get weak. So it could be a good thing and it could be a bad thing if you're a barber. You know, you this is actually saving you in the long run but it does feel cheap. That's the only cons that I really have for you guys. I mean, this is a, this, I, I know everybody's like, hey man, I thought you don't use walls. Hey, I thought you only use fast fees. I mean, I kid you not. I always was like, I'll never use a walls clipper. I will never, I live and die by fast fees. Let me tell you guys, I live and die by fast fees. Masters, I started using the masters again. I started using masters when I first started cutting hair. So I kind of just left those alone because those was heavy but I still use them from time to time but I live and die by Oster Fast Fees. These though, these are in my top five definitely. I mean these are a must get. I'm trying to go cordless a little bit. Definitely these are a must get get you could go pick it up at amazon you can pick it up on ebay i picked mine up on ebay but they're all over the place you guys seeing reviews on these from other youtube barbers i seen his review on these and that really made me you know confirm the purchase so shout out to chris uh it start with a b man ba 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 bossy or something like that bossio bossio or something like that uh yeah shout out to you Good looking out. Good looking out for the review. I'm doing my review. It's your boy 360 Jeezy, and I'm up out of here.